It is the most unforgiving place on Earth. Over 3.5 million square miles. A vast wilderness. It is the Sahara Desert, with people and cultures as unpredictable as the landscape. Running 50 miles a day, it's the challenge, it's going the distance, it's just pushing myself to my limits. It's never been done. No one's ever run that far in that period of time. That will be tough. It's a mental thing, I think. Imagine running 50 miles per day for more than 100 days. In an unprecedented personal challenge, three ultra runners, good friends, test physical strength and mental toughness running across the entire Sahara Desert. They're such high-end athletes. They're used to pushing themselves, but they're gonna be pushing their bodies more than they ever have in the past. We've had injury, we've had sickness. Sorry, dude. The best thing to do would be to stop for the day, but we have to cover some miles today. Any Americans found there without proper paperwork are gonna be considered spies, liable to execution. We You're going to have to make the best decision for us as a team. It's so difficult for me because the personalities are so different. I don't want to push us into the ground, obviously, but I'll push us damn close. This is, you know, a lot tougher than you could have ever thought. You can do this. You don't want to quit. It's OK. <laughs> we saw a young boy, seven or eight years old, in the desert alone, fending for himself while his dad was a two days walk away to get water. That's the water situation. I mean, it's so much bigger an issue than I would have ever thought. Narrated by executive producer Matt Damon and directed by James Mall, a personal and compelling journey into the world's most mysterious wilderness. The purpose of the three of us coming here was to learn more about each other, to learn about the people of the Sahara, and to do something that hasn't been done before. They all three agreed that if one runner went down, they would be out of the expedition. I thought your commitment was different than that. When is the end? The end is when we get to Cairo. It will be a life-changing experience, and not just for the three runners, for everybody who's along on this journey.